I should have used the sitting spring. <laughs> no, there's like nothing on here. Hello there beautiful and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to do a challenge. I was on YouTube recently trying to find some ideas of what video I could do for you guys today and I saw this one dip challenge, I think it's called one dip challenge where you can only dip into your makeup products once before you use them so we're going to try that today and try to do a complete beat so if you're interested to see how this turns out please keep watching okay so let's jump into it so first we're going to start with primer and we can only use one pump you know that's plenty okay Okay, and I think I want to do brows next and I currently am using a pomade for brows so I can only dip into the pomade once. We're gonna see like my eyebrows are hella thick I usually use a lot of product but we are only going to do one dip okay and like don't mind it just one, <laughs> one hella long dip. Okay. Okay, let's see. Little hair. Little. There is legit nothing on this brush already. <laughs> It's empty. Oh, wow. Okay, so I guess that's brows. Um, they do look really sparse, like right between there. This one's not that bad. I should have shaped these up before. We are going to conceal the brows now. Me for concealer, one dip is a lot. Um, I'll do it this way. Let's see. I mean, it's just the brow, so. let's get into our eyeshadow it would be very easy just to do a natural eye look so I'll definitely be trying to use some colors today to see what this turns out like so one dip is a lot for um, concealing the eyes like you can get a lot of primer so let's do that and I think we'll do some pinks into a purple and I'm going to oh, I'm so scared girl y'all we're gonna see where it ends up I know I want to use a purple eyeshadow though okay and I'm like this color is hella light I'm thinking even one dip won't do that much for me but we are going to try and it's gonna be a long swipe Look, it was one dip, okay. <laughs> now we have to like evenly distribute this to both eyes. And like, I cannot go back into that color. Like, that's it, right? So, 
<sighs> we gonna see. Okay, so I've brought you guys in just a little bit so that you could see. I can definitely see a little bit of color payoff for that one. So let's see what other color we can go into to build on that crease. Uh, we're gonna do another long sweep. Okay. Now we are going to try and build. Evenly distribute. This color. Okay. And now I think we are ready for our purple shadow and uh, I think I'm going to start off with a lighter purple in this inner corner. Um, usually I spray these with like setting spray or something but I don't know if I'll be able to do it for multiple colors. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. I mean, I have two purples, so hopefully I can go back into the other one. But we're going to start off with this lighter one first. I'm going to try to do a hella long drag. <laughs> I should have used the setting spray. <laughs> no, there's like nothing on here. can use more colors. Thank God, because... I just can't go back into this one. <laughs> oh, it's, it's done guys, that's it. Like, there's no more. Maybe I'll use my finger, maybe. <laughs> okay, so we'll go into that next um, purple color. Sorry, that color just now was Eres on Show and What's this one? Guau? Why do I keep trying to pronounce these things? It's this one, okay? And now I'm just going to use my finger to try and get some color payoff. Uh, okay, so <laughs> at least we got something this time. Let me try to get some of it on here because at least then I actually got some shadow on my eyelid. And this is just the same brush that I used earlier in my crease. Just going in, kind of blending it out. Not adding any product. Just working with what I have there already. Plumberry color and I'm going to use my finger again. One drag. This is what we got. And I'm placing this, and I'm trying to place this more on the outer portion of my eye here. And I don't know if that really did much for us at all. I brush because I want a clean brush for my crease, so we're just going to go in with this. Don't mind, it's just dirty. There's like no shadow here. <laughs> so, <laughs> we got a lot. Okay, so I'm going to blend this in the outer portion of my eye now. Might have actually gotten a lot more than I needed. So, there is that. Now we're going to do foundation and we can only do one pump. I don't have any dip um, foundation. So we're just going to do one pump for the entire face. Let's see it. Ah, I actually got a lot from a pump. So I don't really think I use this much on a regular. So we should be fine. We should be fine. Oh, I should not use that purple finger. Probably not. Mm -hmm. This is a lot of foundation for me, so I might save a little back. 
just for us to see and make sure if any areas will need any like touching up so I just saved some on the back of my hand there I usually forget it's there and end up at an event out the house with foundation eyeliner eyelash glue just on the back of my hand because I usually have to run out after I am been so late just doing my makeup <laughs> I'm working on it guys I'm working on it okay Don't forget the ears and the neck. But I actually think one pump of foundation was like a lot. Um, like I said, it's probably a little bit more than I even typically use, so. Not bad, not bad. Now concealer, one dip. Not bad, not bad. That's a lot of concealer, so we did well there. Now we are going to do our cream contour. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to get one dip to work. I think I'm gonna have to use like a brush and dig some of this bad boy out. So let's just see. Yeah, so. So now we are ready to blend that bad boy out. We definitely like to add a lot more. <laughs> um, but we get to bronze as well. That's why we do all the double steps, guys. Okay. So now we are going to go with bronzer. And I'm going to use my darker bronzer because I can use less. So, you know, the trick. So we're going to use this color right here. It's the Ace Beauty one, the one that I always use. I don't know how I'm gonna get enough on this brush here. Let's see. That's one dip for me. I don't, I don't care, okay? I don't care. So now I'm going to use a wet um, beauty blender because I definitely think it's going to take up more product than a dry one. And I've already put like my powder in uh, this cover here and I'm using my Fit Me Loose Finish Setting Powder. We're just going to do one really hard dip and this is what we got. Now we're going to distribute it. we're doing that bad of a job guys I definitely would have liked more bronzer but like this is working out to be okay not bad let's do my under eye so I'm going to go in with this pink Pont Ponte Ponte hyper And one long sweep. Ooh, ooh, Spanglish palette coming through with the pigment. Uh, should I just use this one? Now let's see if we can 
but it's definitely there. Might drag it down just a little for a bit more color payoff. And uh, do I wanna go in with a purple? And then I think I'll go in with some purple. Oh, I'm going to go in with this Connie that we used in the crease. One good sweepity sweep. One good dip. And just gonna smoke this um, shadow out a little. And I think that's our eyes, guys. Let's let us put some lashes on. I'm trying to get into lashes for y'all, okay? So that I can teach you the things. My lash glue is like expired though. Don't use expired things on your eyes. I'm in a really good mood today, if you hadn't realized. I don't know why. But we are welcoming it. Cause that does not happen every day. Um, red lashes. Where are the lashes? Found them. They were on the floor right here. Okay, so lashes. Like I was saying, I'm trying to get into the lashes and stuff so that I can demonstrate all of these things. And I, in the video before this one, I actually did wear lashes. It's been like a long time. So I'm going to just use the let's do mascara in the meantime while we wait on the lash glue to dry and it's like this is a lot of mascara okay this is a lot so we should definitely I think we can do blush in the meantime while we wait and I have this beautiful pinky um, blush here from uh, elf um sorry not from elf from shein glam i don't know i haven't used it in a while i don't remember what the color payoff is but we have lots of pink and purple going on so i think this should be really cute again we're going to do one swirl i didn't get a lot guys let's see if i can get something to show up no I see nothing. You can probably try to put these lashes on now. Lips. So before lips, we're going to do highlighter. And the highlighter has to, I have to do one dip of highlighter for my entire, entire face. I swear I can like see a hole through this lash how it's like not even on properly. I'm just gonna power through that though. I think I'm gonna use this Illusion Allison. Jeez, I can't read. This Allison eyeshadow from the It's My Rare palette. And as usual, I'm going to do a nice swirl dip thing. And now we are going to go in for the lips. I'm not going to use a pencil, can't really use one dip. Um, I do have something that I'm working on that I will be using for you guys today. And it's a lip gloss, but I don't know where any of my lip brushes are at the moment. So, ah. Might be too much, let's see. Might even be too much. Now it should be, it should be one pump of setting spray. But really, <laughs> have you seen the size of my face? I'm going to try to put this as far away from my face as possible 
so that it can spread to as much of my face as possible. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and the jade only like it is there. All the cheeks are dry. Ah, uh, it's a good thing I'm not going anywhere. It's a good thing I have nowhere to be. Okay, so this is the finished look. Give you a close up. Can you tell like this, the lashes hanging on for dear life? You probably can. Um, but not much on the cheeks or anywhere else. Um, the eyes, which I thought would have been, the eyes which I thought definitely would have been like the hardest for me to do actually did not turn out that bad so um, but i think it turned out really really good i'm really proud of myself i mean i know i don't usually use like like a lot of makeup anyway so it was fine and i did get this lash these lashes on for you guys so definitely give me a thumbs up for that sticking it out here and trying to get these lashes on even though it took me like an hour give or take um but honestly though um it was really really fun and i hope you guys enjoyed this challenge let me know in the comments down below what are the challenges you guys want to see me try and tackle <laughs> um this one turned out really really well better than i was expecting so that's always a good thing so i hope you guys have an awesome day um, wherever you are in the world and don't forget to be kind to someone today and most importantly to be kind to yourself bye